Hey, it's James Nicholson, and in this video, we're going to look at Facebook Ads domain verification using an HTML file, right? So in the last video, we looked at the DNS verification, and ours is waiting at the moment. It's pending with our host to get updated. So we're going to look at a faster option, which is to use an HTML file. And so you're going to uh, go into settings, business settings. So we're going to go, let's go back there. Start from the beginning. So you're gonna to go to the cog. You're gonna go business settings over here. You're gonna go domains. Uh, and if you watched the last video, you should already have uh, the domain put in there. If you didn't, you just put add and just put the domain name without the www dot. Uh, and then we've already got our domain in there this time, right? So we're gonna go with the HTML file download. And I'm gonna click here and that's gonna download the file that I need. And so that's downloaded now uh, into my documents uh, on my computer. So what we're gonna look at here uh, is grabbing that document. I'm gonna grab that document. Uh, we're gonna find it here. Okay, so uh, it's put it into my stuff here. Um, and then I am going to just drag that using FTP into my WordPress, right? So I'm just gonna click it in here into the root. Uh, and I wouldn't ask you to do this if you're not um, a marketing person, if you don't know FTP. All you should do is take this file here, download it and give it to your web guy, right? Uh, or you can find someone on a website like Fiverr or Upwork and get someone to just do this. So you just need to know what you need to do. Uh, and what you need to do is download this HTML file and get it into uh, the root of your domain name, right? And there's tons of people online doing this stuff for you guys. Uh, so just spend five quid, right, and get it done. Uh, but at least you know what needs to do, right? So let's just try this. Uh, it should be there. Cool. Great. So, I mean, it's not looking like much. It's a load of gobbledygook, right? Uh, but that's the file that Facebook wanted us to uh, upload. And hopefully we click verify now. It should verify our domain name. So it should verify our name. Yep. Great. We're verified. And that's what we needed to do. We needed to get our domain name verified. So we are done. And that's the easiest way to do it. Uh, the file is really, really easy. Now, the, the, the DNS way that I said in the last way is more of a longer term thing. Uh, if you're uploading the file as we have done here, you can see that here. Uh, that needs to stay there. Right, so if any web guy uh, or anything like that does any work on here, don't let them delete that, right? You need to let them know that that's there because someone might take on your website in a few years and they think, oh, look, that looks weird, a load of gobbledygook, what's that? Uh, well, it's there and it needs to stay there or you won't be permitted to advertise, right? And so I recommend you do the DNS version as well because that stays in your hosting and uh, it will always be there. So you've got a backup, right? You've got two ways to do this. Uh, and well, there's three ways. There was another way, which is a meta tag way, which isn't the, the best way in my opinion. So this one was the HTML file upload. Very simple there. Uh, and now we are verified, which is good news. Uh, and we can advertise more effectively using iOS 14 and beyond. So that's it. Um, I hope you found that useful. Cheers, guys.